now let's look at uh, the method of generating the samples using the acceptance rejection method of the monte carlo simulation right so it is necessary to simulate samples from a distribution with a density function of this much i have to generate the samples whose density function is like this use acceptance rejection technique to construct a complete algorithm for generating samples from f by first generating samples from the distribution with the density h of x equal to 2 into 1 minus x so first thing i have to take this as the base so from here uh, i would also require to find out the di distribution function for this so which is nothing but integration from 0 to 2 0 to x 2 into 1 minus t dt which uh, becomes integral 0 to x 2 minus 2t dt this becomes 2x minus 2 into t squared by 2 which is t squared x squared so the density function will become the distribution function will become 2x minus x squared now using the acceptance rejection method the way we have to go with is you go with the uh, c find c where which is nothing but the maximum of f of x divided by h of x that is one thing that i have to go with so f of x is 6x into 1 minus x h of x is 2 into 1 minus x i need to find the maximum of that so going away it becomes the maximum of 3x and i know that x lies only between 0 to 1 so the maximum of 3x is 3 so the value of uh, c for me is 3 right now now using this distribution i will have to generate a random numbers so it's as good as this distribution i'll equate it to some random number z that is generated so which means x square x from here if i have to find out it is nothing but x squared minus 2x plus z equal to 0 x is minus b 2 plus r minus square root of b squared, which is 4 minus 4 ac 4z by 2. So x comes out as 2 plus r minus 2 root 1 minus z by 2. So x comes out as 1 plus r minus square root of 1 minus z by 2. and uh, here x is lying only between 0 to 1 so which means 1 plus something will not be working out so x for me is 1 minus of square root of 1 minus z by 2 so this is what will come out to be or oh, sorry now there is no more 2 right because 2s all got cancelled off so it is 1 minus of square root of 1 minus z so that is what we will see as a part of our algorithm so let's uh, try generating it now i'll say random numbers right probably a few of them i'll generate using uh, the rand function i'll generate using the rand function of excel let's say i'm generating a few random numbers right these are a few random numbers that i have generated now for each these are zs now corresponding to the z right corresponding to the z i need to generate x i need to compute x which is nothing but 1 minus of square root of 1 minus z so this comes out to be the values of xs corresponding xs are coming through this mechanism then i am again generating some u 
again from a random numbers itself. So I am using the rand function again from a uniform distribution. I am generating the use. Now, what is the acceptance rejection method says? Yeah, as long as, as long as u is less than f of x di divided by c times h of x. Right? If u is less than f of x divided by c times h of x, which means u has to be less than 6x into 1 minus x c is the maximum value which is 3 times h of x 2 into 1 minus x which means in this case 6 is going off so as long as u is less than x right as long as u is less than x you take y equal to x whatever is uh, that we are generating you take that to be equal to x otherwise you ignore it so as long as u is less than x so accept or reject criteria is as long as u is less than x if u is less than x go ahead with the x otherwise you ignore it because you have to generate it again so in this case i am not able to generate and probably in these cases the values are generated in these cases the values are ignored so these will become the generated values as a part of our workout as a part of the accept reject sampling that is coming out accept reject based monte carlo simulation that is coming out these would become the generated values and rest of the values are getting ignored for us so these are the ones that would uh, traditionally uh, follow f of x equal to 6x into 1 minus x distribution which we are trying to do using the acceptance rejection method. Alright.